Few days ago, Apple introduced、uh, the new MacBook Pro and the iMac during its、uh, Apple event. The new products looks、uh, gorgeous. They offer a seamless ecosystem and、uh, are known for their build quality. The thing is that、uh, the base model comes with only eight gigabytes of unified memory, and、uh, it started、uh, with.、Uh, Sixteen hundred U.S. dollar. All right, it's fifteen ninety nine technically, before tax. If you have been watching some of my previous videos, I built a computer that cost one thousand U.S. dollar less, but has far better specs than the sixteen hundred new MacBook Pro. Let's、uh, break、uh, my cost down. As just shown here, all the new component price、uh, total three eighty five U.S. dollars. That's、uh, not including the monitor and the mouse, but that can be as low as、uh, around one hundred U.S. dollars. The best part is that.、Uh, It can be turned into a 16 gigabytes VRAM GPU, which is far more than 8 gigabytes of unified memory from the new MacBook Pro. I think that has a big advantage, as I demonstrated previously. It was able to run almost all the major AI applications. If you haven't watched them, I highly recommend that you can watch them. I will include、uh, the link in the description. So here is、uh, the comparison. Basically, I used、uh, less than five hundred、uh, US dollars to build a system that、uh, is able to compare head to head with a shiny new MacBook Pro from Apple. What do you think? Are you going to be grabbing one of the new MacBook Pro? Or are you leaning towards Team AMD? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks everyone for tuning in today. I hope you like my video. Please subscribe to support me. Thank you very much. Goodbye.